the Sunoco Modifieds. And we are green. They'll charge down into turns one and two. Dave Constantino rim running it around the bone shaker. Steve Akers to take the lead. Schilling drops into the number three spot. Hohen forced it early fourth. Moreska drifts up, throws the block on Friesen to have the fifth position as they'll come around here for the end of lap number one business as we flash back here's Di Lorenzo battling to the inside of Jessica Friesen Moresca will clear Acres. that'll move him into fourth and now just trying to move into fifth and at the front of the field here comes the thrilling David Schilling the 1-800 got junk car up into the number two spot now chasing after early race leader Constantino as Hohen Forrest and Schilling are joined by Moresca Di Lorenzo powers his way around the outside of Jessica Fries and closes in on the back end of Schilling just coming back and there's Stewie as they all come off turn number four here as we hit lap number nine and here's Moresca coming to the low side to take second from Hohenforst. I tell you what, Moresca grabbing that number two spot. The other car on the move is Matt DiLorenzo. He is now working the inside of Josh Hohenforst. And here comes Stewie. Stewie now working on the inside of uh, David Schilling's number 20 as they make their way down the backstretch into turn number three. Freezing down to the inside. Schilling to the high side as they are following Matty D going down. And now it looks like Freezing grabbing that spot from Schilling is now he's going to work on the inside of Matt DiLorenzo. DiLorenzo just turned his head left and said, oh, there's the 44. I better pour it on, which he did down the backstretch going into turn number three. Oh, yeah, and Moresco will look down to the inside. It don't look, but there's traffic ahead for the leaders in about the next lap and a half to two laps. So that's going to factor in if we stay green. Moresco bangs wheels with Constantino down the front stretch and pulls the slider off turn number two. Constantino runs out of room on the outside of turn Turn two, Mariska taking the lead by about two car lengths now going into turns three and four. Yeah, I tell you what, Constantino was like, wait a second, where did you come from, Mariska? And Mariska trying to play it safe. He got up there, got the lead, and now here comes Friesen. Friesen going around the lap cars, gave him a drive, and he just got past Constantino. So Stuart Friesen and now in that number two spot, going to try to run down Michael Mariska. And, and Friesen... Well, he gets to split the bounty, right? Isn't that the deal there, Mer Mimi? Yeah, he'd get half the money. The other half would go to a charity. Here comes Stewie off turn number two. He needs to make this pass to have a shot at the championship, and no problem. He clears Mariska. Now, what Friesen has to hope is that Mariska burns the tires off, and Constantino and a couple of other drivers can actually get by. Mariska's not giving Battling up, though. back. Battling back hard. This is the battle for the number one spot, folks, watching at home. And Mareska is going for a championship. He's running that car awful hard for this. Like you said, Paul, I believe if he finishes right behind Friesen, he still wins the championship by four points. Maybe he doesn't know that. Maybe that's why he's racing this hard. But man, oh man, folks, we have eight laps to go here in this 30-lap main event. Oh, look at that. Mareska just slamming the door shut. Friesen tries to open it back up as they battle alongside Darwin Green going down the backstretch and into turn number three. Moresco would love to be able to put the lap car of green between himself and Friesen. They're both going to truck the inside lane coming off turn number four now with six laps left to go. And, and here comes Stewie again quick. Yeah, Stewie is trying to reel him in. He's going down low here in turns three and four. Two laps left to go. Moresco will give no quarter coming off the corner, but Friesen will have the lead at the line as they charge up into one and two, and he might be able to drive away here from Moresco. But remember, if Moresco finishes behind Friesen. He may not win the battle, but he wins the war. Absolutely. And now Friesen out in front. Mareska going to be in that number two spot. Mimi's jumping up and down with the bounty because now she gets hoping it's going to charity. A lot anyways, Friesen, one to go. White flag being displayed to your leaders. Mareska in that number two spot. As they're making their way down the back stretch, two turns and a checkered flag. And here they come, roaring into turns three and four. Friesen will clear the Roger Henyon number 44 machine. The double checkers will wave. Stuart Friesen wins tonight. Sunoco modified feature and unofficially with a second place finish. Michael Moresca is your 2020 Sunoco modified track. Leader.